In other news now, the Secretary to the Government of the Federation, Boss Mustafa, has threatened that the contract for the rehabilitation of the Yola Mobi Road in Adamawa State might be revoked as he gave a one-week ultimatum to the contractor, AG Vision, to return to site. The obviously displaced SGF expressed displeasure over the contractor's handling of the project despite the huge amount collected so far. The movement of even the produce of NNPC to the northern part of Adama all the way to Mokong because we have a major depot here in Yola and uh, we need to get this road uh, quickly done. So I'm giving you the assurance that uh, we are taking special interest to ensure that this road is done. And that's why I imagine the contractor, they have promised that they are going to put two guns at the, uh, I mean, immediately after the Santa festivities. One starting from uh, Song area going back to Yola and the other one uh, starting from where? From Kala. From Kala all the way to Kala. So we believe that uh, we will see action. But when I return in the next one week or two, you will all be here. We will follow the road again in the same manner we did today so that we will put all the necessary pressure. It is not only for government. You as members of the fourth realm have a responsibility to ensure accountability. Not only accountability, but when a project is on, it must be completed for the good of the people. So when I return again, who will come up? I will stop here in the quarry, we will ask you what you've been able to achieve. I will go with you and see what you have been able to achieve. I'm assuring the people of Adama that this road, within the shortest possible time, we will see visible and meaningful progress. Most of our further assured that the federal government remains committed to giving Nigerians good roads and other infrastructure, stressing that the NNPC will inject funds into the project because of its strategic importance linking Borno and Adamawa State. Speaking in the same vein, the Minister of Transportation, who oversees the Ministry of Works, Moazo Sambo Aji, told the contractor that their company is exhibiting incompetence. <laughs> Government that should be all in construction. Why is it that in this case that he has our money and he has not done the work for us? This is the meaning of this. What is that? So we cannot talk about safe funding. If he had worked for billions and has not been paid, then you will say there is a problem of funding. But here, we have money with him. He has not delivered as much as. However, the site engineer Francis Musa argued that work stopped because of the Sala break and would resume this week. By next week, let me resume from Sala will now introduce two teams. One will be working from Sampoziola and one will be working from Kalakotu. And uh, we, are, we, are, we are putting hope and we are assuring you that something else will come out. What's the news, sir? What? Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.